All right then, so currently on this Ninjas Index page, we're showing all the ninjas, which is awesome, but at the minute, we're showing all 50 ninjas on a single page. And if there were 100 ninjas, we'd show all 100 ninjas. And that's a lot of data to show on just a single page. Normally, when we have high volumes of data like this, we implement some kind of pagination where we might show 10 and then click the next button to show the next 10 and so forth. So that's what we're going to look at in this lesson. So then to add pagination, we just need to do a couple of things. The first thing we need to do is head to the controller file and into the index function, which gets all the ninjas currently from the database table. And where we do that, instead of using this get method, which just returns all of the ninjas in one go, we can use the paginate method. And then as an argument to this, we can say how many records that we want to show on each page. For example, that could be 10. So then Laravel fetches the first 10 for us when we visit the index page now, and we're going to pass those first 10 into the index view, which we then see on the page. When we go to the next page of ninjas, Laravel is going to grab the next 10 for us and so forth. OK, so that was the first step, which was really easy to do, right? The next step is to show the pagination links on the index page where we render those ninja records. So let's head to that index view. And then right at the bottom of the page somewhere, we want to add those pagination links to go from one page to the next, right? And again, this is really, really easy to do in Laravel. We just need to use a set of curly braces to output some kind of dynamic value. And then within those, we can reference the ninja's data, which gets passed into this view, remember? Now, when we use pagination on a resource, like the ninjas in this case, Laravel then gives us a method on that resource called links which we can invoke right here. And when we do that, Laravel dynamically injects all the template and functionality for those pagination links right here. And that is all we need to do, my friends. So now we've implemented a pagination system for the ninjas resource by just using two simple methods. All right, so now on the home page, if we scroll down, you're just gonna see 10 records, awesome. And then at the very bottom, we get a nicely styled little pagination bar. And we also see this thing over here showing one to 10 of 50 results. So we can cycle through these to go to the next pages. We can also click on the arrows to go left and right as well through the pages. And notice up here in the URL, we have a little query parameter, which is called page. And that's set equal to whatever page number we're on. So I could go to page four and I would see the fourth page of ninjas. So we can link directly to those pages if we wanted to as well. Pretty awesome, right? And it looks nice too.